Do you support the pilots, don't you, McBarry? Yes, I support the pilots. I support them. You support their claim? I support their claim 100%. So let's have a quick look at that. Um, pilots have not had a pay increase since 2019, five years ago. Now, do you believe Aer Lingus disputes that particular fact? Uh, they can dispute it all they like. Uh, I think the, the, the facts show that there hasn't been a, a real pay increase for five years. Here's another fact. Aer Lingus made profit last year of 225 million euro and the group that they're part of, the international group IEG, 3.5 billion euro. No pay increase for the pilots. So yes, uh, I support them 100%. We will be supporting them on the floor of the doll. And if it comes to picket lines, we will support them on the picket lines as well. Of course, we hope that this issue is resolved. I think it can be resolved. But Aer Lingus need to come to their senses and pay a decent pay increase, which covers the price increases that we've seen okay, over so the last five years. The recommendation from the Labour Court, I think, was for just over 9%. There was a separate recommendation from another industrial um, tribunal that they brought in to, to deal with this. I think that was around 12, 12.25%. Aer Lingus agreed to both of those. You don't think that's good enough? How much have prices increased over the space of the last five years? They've increased by well over 20%. The Labour Court recommendation would have meant a de facto 10% pay cut or more for these workers. And there's a point here that I'd like to make briefly. I hope that the pilots win their claim or the bulk of their claim. And I hope that if they do it, they set an example to other groups of workers and trade unionists in the country to say, our pay has been effectively cut. Our pay effectively has not kept up with the price increases. We should follow that example and join unions and use that power okay. to get decent pay increases for work. I'm just looking, I suppose, for people who, home who might be wondering what the scale of the pay increase here. They could be looking at about €49,000 extra a of year an of an increase. That is above the wage that 3,500 out of the 5,000 workers in that airline will get. And would you think, yes, that's still OK? Well, I think that would surprise people like Barry. OK, I, I think some of the figures that have been quoted have been selective. So let me select a figure. The starting rate for a pilot, starting rate of 60,000, an increase of 23% on that is very, very far from the figure that you quoted there. And it's, it's important. Okay, but those figures are also accurate. I think there's about 200 pilots, they're saying, within Aer Lingus. Their pay under this claim that they have will go from 287,000 to 349,000 euro a year. Most people would think even 287,000 is a pretty decent wage. I think you're mentioning some, some of the captains there, but mm. the starting rate of pay in Aer Lingus is around the 60,000 mark, and it can increase to double that after a period of 22 years. 22 years doing a really difficult, highly skilled and responsible job. And again, I make the point, this isn't just about the pilots. If the pilots win on this issue, they set a headline for other group of workers to say, we want pay increases that at least cover what we've lost in the last number of years with the price rises and inflation. Oh.